Hey guys, it's Kathy Joe, and welcome to my channel, Kathy Joe. And I wanted to start off with a video at Home Goods to look at the Halloween stuff. And this channel is going to be about looking at different shops and the different things they have. And this is one of my favorite stores this time of year. I'm doing this voiceover because the audio was no good <laughs> when I was there. It was very loud and I wasn't talking loud enough. Keep in mind, I'm sitting in a wheelchair. I am disabled. And so everything is from a sitting position. And I'm just did a quick video to show you what I found. Of course, there's a lot of Ray Dunn stuff, which is what I was looking for. I'm a huge fan of Ray Dunn. When you walk in, you have the more traditional Halloween stuff. And you'll see my hand in the frame sometimes because I was talking. I really like the different colors they have for the Halloween and the Thanksgiving, uh, the autumn. I've never seen like blue things like blue pumpkins and green for autumn. I thought it was really cool, but it really kind of does fit in with South Florida, which is where I live. And this is more Ray Dunn stuff, which of course I will show you at the end what I bought. I just love her stuff. And that's a great thing for bobbing for apples. There was so much Ray Dunn stuff. Last year when I went, I could not find anything Ray Dunn for Halloween. So I don't know that's if that's because I started shopping earlier, because it is only August when I did this, or is she not as popular as she used to be, or are they just producing more stuff? So I hope it's the the last one I said. I got that um, You're So Corny thing. I bought, I bought the Fright Night. This hat I really liked. That's my husband holding it for me, but it was super heavy. It was like $40 and I was just terrified if I took it home, it would break or something would happen. It's a cookie jar and I love it. Maybe I'll go back and get it because I really, I really do love it. Um, here's some more Ray Dunn. They have so many Ray Dunn mugs. It was insane. I mean, hundreds and hundreds. They were amazing, and uh, I just fell in love with all of them. I would love to have, like, a whole wall in my house full of Ray Dunn mugs. That bowl is fantastic, which is not Ray Dunn. I will say this about Home Goods: There's not a lot of organization. They do a little bit. Like, here you have some Thanksgiving, some autumn stuff. There is some organization there, but not as much as Hobby Lobby. And I think it's because they have a lot of turnover of items and they just kind of place everything where it aesthetically fits. And as I get closer to the register, you you will see that. Here it's a little more organized on these kinds of center displays, but it's not all Ray done. There's other things like you have a Thanksgiving bowl thrown in probably because there was just room to put it. Now in the front here, this is pretty nice. They have a lot of autumn and fall themed. I love those bags. They were really glittery. You can't really tell here. Really glittery and really cute. Lots of nice pumpkins and things. I love tea towels. I actually like to collect tea towels. And I do have a lot of these spatulas. And I did buy some Ray Dunn spatulas. They came with cookie cutters. I'll be able to make some fun Halloween cookies. Probably do that um, closer to October, obviously. So those are the ones I bought. I bought two sets. I just couldn't resist. I got this one and I got the Hocus Pocus and the Boo. I thought they were really cute and I just have them in a whole thing in my kitchen with all kinds of different spatulas. Here's more mugs and I just could not decide. I was so happy to see a mug with her name on it. I thought that was really great. I love this one. I did not get it. Maybe I'll go back and get it next time because the color, it looks more yellow here, but in person it's like a mustard. And I didn't love the color, um, but I really like these iridescent mugs. I thought they were great. I thought that was a really nice one, but this is a whole hodgepodge of mugs different themes, some are Halloween, some are faith-based. Really no rhyme or reason. I did get that little cookie jar with the pumpkin on top, the black one, I thought it was so cute. And I kind of wish I bought the white one to go with it. Here's another display of candles. Lots of different scents and different kinds, but I already have a ton of candles from Yankee Candle in my house. 
So I didn't get any this time. And here we have some more displays. Again, the displays are not as nice as Hobby Lobby, but they don't really have Halloween stuff at Hobby Lobby. So you go to Home Goods and Marshalls and things like that. They do have a lot of cool things. I did buy this Jack O' Lantern guy because I love Harlequin patterns. I love it. You see, I'm pointing to the Harlequin. That's like one of my favorite things. Anything with a Harlequin, I'm going to want to buy it. So I did buy this and you'll see it at the end of the video. It's really cute. Here's a few more like outdoor lanterns, which would be great all lit up. Some pumpkin lights, really cute things. And I really like the colors of these Thanksgiving items. I thought they were really beautiful with the white and the pink, really different. Normally you see a lot of oranges and yellows. So these were a little different to, to put out for this time of year, which I thought it was really nice. And here's some more autumn mixed with kind of a Halloween. I know you can use pumpkins for autumn, but usually jack-o'-lanterns are for Halloween and the, the pumpkins on the bottom are jack-o'-lanterns because they have the face that's going to light up. The rest of the stuff was like cornucopia, autumn, some potpourri. Here we have even more Ray Dunn mugs. Again, they're not really organized. And this is near the front of the register. Again, no rhyme or reason. Everything's just kind of thrown out there. And I understand that. I think this place has a lot of turnover and they just probably don't have time to really, really organize everything super, super nice. It's definitely very busy and it's going to get even busier. So they could clear these shelves by now. You know, I was there a week and a half ago. These could be all new stuff by now. So if you really are looking for things, go back. If you don't find what you're looking for, you're bound to find something new, but you really sometimes do have to search to find those little treasures that really match your decor and what you're looking for. And we have a little uh, witch here, which is kind of funny. And some other things here. I did see, now that I'm looking at it now, um, some really cute retro things like that little cat on the pumpkins, adorable. There was another little retro thing that reminded me of something my grandma would have had. Those things are really nice. More Ray Dunn mugs, so many. Some Snoopy mugs. I like the one with the potion, the green one. I thought that was really cute. Lots and lots of mugs. And we have some pillows here. A big mix, some Ray Dunn, some other ones. I didn't really love the pillows. Even more mugs. I mean, they had so many mugs, it was insane. I love the black mugs with the orange on the inside. I got a couple of those. I think they're really, really cute. And you'll see soon what I took home, mixed in with some of my other decorations. I'm not finished decorating for Halloween. I have to add some lights and some other cute things. I have some more things coming, but I can show you what I have so far. So here we go. Here you see my Ray Dunn items that I picked up along with that jack-o'-lantern in the back with the Harlequin. Um, I also mixed it with my peanuts. I've had that for a while, I love it. I also got the candy corn and I put it next to actual candy corn. And I got this candy bucket uh, that says trick or treat. I thought it was so cute. I just love the orange and the black. And I got this mug, some candles. I liked the, the black pumpkins that said Fright Night because it reminds me of that 80s movie about the vampires that's kind of scary. And I have another Charlie Brown Autumn uh, for the Great Pumpkin, which is one of my favorite specials. I did get this Witch Please little hat thing. It's not a cookie jar or anything. It's just decorative. I loved it. And I have that Mickey Mouse um, pumpkin I got from Disney World a while ago. A few other decorations I got from Walmart. This treat thing I got at QVC. I just got that in the mail. Uh, this pillow I also got on QVC. It does light up, so I turn that on at night. It's awesome, I love it. And here's some things from Walmart and QVC and a big candy bowl. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. Happy Halloween, and you will see more videos just like this coming up very soon.